what's up, Mark from Wandering Souls, back with a new video. Um, this time a CD update. Um, just recorded it at, after the vinyl B section video, uh, so it might look the same. Sorry for that. Uh, <coughs> anyways, I got some CDs here to show you. Uh, three uh, CDs, uh, two I got from New Era Productions and one I got from Black and Grand Green Productions. Um, yeah, let's start with the New Era of, uh, Production ones. Um, first up is Kendall Kendall Blar 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 um with uh, Necro Telepathy. Um, an album a lot of people show, have shown already um, first album by this band from Portugal um, not, not much known about this band um, there were some connections with uh, Black Solis um, um, you definitely can uh, could tell that because of the front of the man on the back with the hood Hooded man. <coughs> Anyways, um, yeah, it's a bit in the same vein, raw black metal with some changing vocals, really raw stuff. So there could be connection to that. Um, uh, it's a bit, um, yeah. It's, it has a, a nice, strange atmosphere to it, but the grim. Um, it's raw. Yeah, back by at uh, least by Altara Productions from Portugal. Um, inside, let's take the booklet out. Although it's not a really big one, you could see it a bit better. Uh, not much glare like this, so it's pretty cool then. <coughs> The inside are just lyrics and stuff. Um, yeah, definitely recommend it if you're into Black Solis and bands like that. Um, it's not completely the same as Black Solis, so it's, it's if there was a connection, um, it's not a shame to have it. Um, Sometimes people bands make other CDs and they start to sound the exact the same to their really stuff they already made and I think then yeah what's the use in bringing it out on this name but it's not really the case with this one um, and then Brahm is uh, yeah a thing apart I think and um, yeah. Definitely want to grab their compilation CD also, also as well um, that they released after this one. Um, anyways, I'm enjoying this one. Uh, two long tracks, they're like 16 17 minutes a piece, I think. Um, <coughs> yeah, makes like 40 uh, 34 minutes for one uh, two tracks, it's pretty lengthy, but um, <coughs> yeah, great stuff. Um, so, Candelabrum, it's a tongue breaker for me, so you can elaborate with necrotelepathy. <coughs> Next up is some UK death metal, and this is Triumvir Fall with Spiritual Bloodshed. It's their second album, and definitely their best one <coughs> yet. Sorry for the glare. Um, awesome raw, heavy death metal, dark sounding also a bit. Um, <coughs> inside of the booklet, it's not much, but um, it's in there. Um, this one is uh, released by Invictus Productions from Ireland. Um, <coughs> but this is an aws awesome death metal. I said it was UK because I got a brain fart. I think this is American band. Sorry, they're from Portland. Um, I don't know, maybe because I saw Invictus, I thought somewhere, uh, 
somewhere British or something, I don't know. Um, the label is from Ireland and the band is from the United States. Sorry for the fall. Um, maybe it's a triumvir fall, I don't know. <laughs> Sorry. Um, uh, this is some very cool death metal uh, indeed. And um, yeah, gonna be in my year list and I think pretty high too. Uh, so really enjoying this album. Um, Spiritual Bloodshed by Trevor Fall. Definitely highly, highly recommend it if you are into a dark death metal like that, like Incantation and that kind of emulation, uh, that kind of stuff. Um, not really technical band, but just straightforward dark death metal. And if you like that, then you are. Then it, this is your stuff. <coughs> Last one is released by um, Black and Green um, pr production from Greece. This is their uh, could be stayed a second album, but yeah, I don't know. This is Obscuritator with the newest release. I'm and don't, and don't gonna pronounce it because it's in Bosnian and I don't speak Bosnian so I hope it will focus and then you can read what the album title is back of the CD okay we'll take the booklet out first we're gonna show you the CD and what's behind the tray <coughs> Front cover, uh, inside of the booklet, and the back. Came also with two stickers, um, one of the album of the band, Obscurity sticker, and one of the label. Anyways, great stuff. Um, Definitely gonna be in my list too. Um, I don't think I'm gonna put it high, as high as why it is gonna do, but um, definitely like this. Um, this is definitely more straightforward than the previous release. A uh, bit, it's the harsh, raw, um, raw black metal. Um, yeah, this Bosnian guy did a really good job. Um, yeah, great stuff. Um, if you don't know Obscuritatum, buy it. Is all is gonna definitely gonna show you more about this. Uh, if, I think he did a review on this as well. Um, yeah, great stuff. <coughs> uh, definitely highly recommendable if you are into raw black metal. And um, yeah, more aggressive than the previous release um, but it also lost a bit of the harsh noise which was added a bit to the first one um, <coughs> but anyways I still like it and um, yeah great stuff obscure them with the latest release go check it out if you don't know it already and um, let me know what you think in the comment section also counts if you something other to say just put it down there um, that's it for this video uh, thank you for watching liking supporting if you get something to say just put it down there in the comment section links will be in the description to those releases and uh, make you can judge yourself and uh, if you like this video give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more subscribe to my channel and hit the little bell you get all the updates and um yeah that's it hope to see you guys with the next video uh you'll see what that is but um thank you take care and have a nice day ciao